Hey guys, Two Zombie Slayers here, and today I finished my bolt carrier. It's a little front heavy. <laughs> and, well, it's not completely finished. That's just there for aesthetics. Like, even Piston German ARs have just this without the holes in it, and it's not going to have a hole in it. But, yeah, the bottom is flat, completely flat, because I can get away with that and not having to put the little, um, piece that's usually on the bottom is like a guide to push the hammer down but I've got this name to pop primers by installing this two pieces of nail because the original nail wasn't long enough to do to go through that and basically I can take this and I'm going to clean this front end up later with baking soda and super glue but I can take this slide that in there and it's not all the way tight tight in there like it, you can see it wobbles you can see it just about wobbling there but it doesn't matter and then this fits around the rim of the cartridge which this won't be the, the the bolt but that's what i use for now because i got it to pop a primer <laughs> i got it to pop a primer with it but basically take that and i'll take the front part of this broken nail put it inside of here just barely, just at least enough so they can come out. And I slide that into there all the way back. Put this in the very back. And there it is. So if I put my finger at the very back of that nail, that comes forward a little bit. But then if I was to say, I don't know a good way to show this. Let me, and I push that back, that's back. The other nail is sitting there. You can see it just shining in there because I have no light for it. But basically, once you push the back far enough, it pops out about that much. So, you can see it moving. So, it's really strong. And I've got it to pop primers by having it without the buffer tube and push to a certain point forward which is right behind I have this back surface lined up perfectly with the back of the surface and I hold the barrel at the front with the line in it well primer only and I hold it at the front where it goes and then when I um pull the trigger it pops it it didn't pop the first four times because I didn't realize but the material um, that it was like coming in touching that so I had to fix that but that's what it did so I can take all of this out but basically actually I'm not gonna take it out yet I'm just gonna take the nails out give me a second cuz I'm gonna set it up the exact way that I did to show y'all how I initially got it to fire or pop off a primer I should say all right so basically those two surfaces are completely aligned which means it's gonna smack perfectly and hit where it needs to hit you can see not really an overhang or anything I don't know how good y'all can see it but I had it like this and the hit camera is in my there it is phone that I'm using to record is in my hand so I can't show the way I was holding it but basically just like that and I held it all together and pulled the trigger until it fired and it went off with a bang so yeah my bolt carrier is almost done I'm gonna build the gas key with the piston and when I do that I'm gonna start building my gas block and this is already part of my upper because why not it slips in there with barely any wiggle room barely any room to wiggle you can see barely any but that'd be taken away because I'm gonna put little rails on the side like there really are to have the little guide rails just to keep it from bumping around it won't really matter much but not for me but I'm gonna do it anyway and yeah if y'all enjoyed the video like and subscribe it's up to you and goodbye.